like you shouldn't fall into a career. You should like choose it. You could test, you know, and then like choose it. Um, so I, so in college I worked full time. And so I got, I, I got a job doing telemarketing. And what I realized I was able to do was get uncomfortable and deal with rejection better than most people who had been doing the job for like for years and years and years. And I think somebody had asked me this, a similar type of question recently. And I don't know what it comes from, but I think it's like, I was, I was like the number two class clown in my high school of like 2000 people. And they, they didn't call it a class clown. It was like, it really means I was like a, like a classroom disruptor. So like, I've never had a problem like challenging authority or, you know, like, not like viewing myself as a peer. And I think what happens in sales by, by people struggle or even like the mental concept is like, they always feel like they're intruding on somebody. I've just never had that feeling. I feel like I'm helping that. Like, why are you selling something if you don't think it actually helps somebody? And so for me, I think whether it was delusion or, you know, I don't know, talking to myself, I feel like I was able to convince myself like, look, I'm here to help this other person. So why am I nervous? Why am I, why am I not okay getting a little uncomfortable and being like, well, look, Kim, how, you know, have you thought about it this way? Because I really truly believe that what I'm going to sell them is going to make an impact.